Hello friends, in this lecture we will take a look at comments. So whenever you are doing a project which is really big or even if it is small, it is a good practice to include comments as you proceed in your project. Say for example you are designing a website. So first you will be having a header section. So you will write inside your comment that you are starting your header section. As we have seen in our HTML section, how to use HTML comments. Now here in this lecture, we will see how to use comments in JavaScript. There are two types of comments that you can use in JavaScript. One is single line comment and another is multi line comment. Let's write here so script type equals text slash JavaScript and inside here, let's write document dot write hello world and at last provide semicolon now let's save it come here hit refresh and here it is hello world triple l let's provide double l okay so now we have double l hello world <laughs> okay so say for example now you are going to add a script for adding two elements so let's provide double slashes and write here addition script see now it's a comment let's try it here let's provide double slashes and see now it's a comment now if you save it come here hit refresh we have no output because this is now being treated as a comment. Let's remove the comment. So this is a single line comment. Now we will see a multi line comment. Say for example, you have your addition program here. Then you are writing something say blah blah blah. Right here only blah 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 like this. Then just copy it. Press Ctrl C and paste it for few lines now let's provide here double slashes you will see that this line is now commented but what about these so in these kind of cases where you have multi line comments you need to provide a slash and after that slash just provide an asterisk now at the end provide asterisk and then another slash that's it now this is a comment so in this way you can provide multi-line comment and using double slashes you can use single line comment so that's it here i conclude this lecture see you in the next lecture till then have fun take care